Добро пожаловать в разговорный клуб онлайн-школы английского языка Skying. Здесь наши ученики практикуют свои разговорные навыки. Если вы хотите изучать английский с нами, то запишитесь на пробное занятие, и мы вам в этом поможем. Ссылку вы видите на экране. Если вы уже являетесь нашим студентом, то всю информацию о разговорных клубах вы найдете в своем личном кабинете. Ну а теперь начинаем! Okay. As far as you know, and as far as I told you before, we are going to talk about work, and we are going to find an ideal job for all of us for tonight. I will show you the presentation. Just give me a second. Here we are. So, uh, as usual, we will start with introduction, and the main question here is, are you happy with your job? And of course, I want to know why. And if you say that you are not happy or you are actually unhappy, of course, you need to say why not. Okay, Vlada, can you be the first, please? Uh, yes, sure. Uh, currently, I live in law school, and mm -hmm. I'm happy with my job because I would be happy with any job because job uh, gives money, and money gives you opportunity to buy food, clothes, education. Also, if uh, the job has flexible hours, mm -hmm. you can work from home and also uh, devote your time uh, to your hobby. So that's mm -hmm. why I have such opportunity and I'm happy with my job. Okay, brilliant answer. Thank you so much. Elizaveta, what do you think? Uh, I'm also happy with my job. Uh, um, mm, uh, I live not so far from my office. Uh, I think ten uh, minutes uh, uh, walking. Okay. Uh, and uh, it is not very big company. Only forty people in it um, are working in it. Uh, so uh, it is very flexible uh, team. Uh, we uh, uh, communicate. Uh, very easy, uh, and uh, uh, all members of our team uh, uh, are young and uh, uh, smart, <laughs> so it is very comfortable to work with them. Mm -hmm. Okay, thank you so much. So, Alona, what do you think? Mm, I'm really happy with my job, mm -hmm. and because it's very interesting and uh, it makes me. Uh, it's it makes me uh, my brain. And can you can you repeat one more time? It's make my brain more clear. Ah, so it makes your brain clear. Yeah. Okay. Yes. Mm -hmm. And. Uh, I don't know. It's interesting every day. Okay. I have uh, I have a huge exercise for my uh, brain again, mm -hmm. and it's very well. Okay. Thank you very much, Ivan. What do you think? How do you see it? <coughs> uh, I I am happy with my work <coughs> because my work is very interesting and uh, very. Uh, <coughs> need to uh, brain. <laughs> 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 your work needs brain. Interesting. Yes. You yes. mean you you mean that you need to work with your brain, yeah? When you come yes, to the office. Yes. Mm -hmm. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Uh, and um, it is interesting for me. It is. Uh, I have a salary, of course, and. I like my job. <laughs> Would you like to work physically, not with your brain, but with your hands, for example? Would you? Um, maybe it is uh, depends on what uh, need to do. I think. Mm -hmm. Okay, I see. Thank you for the answer, Ekaterina. As as far as I understood, you, now you don't work, right? Right. And uh, you want to find a job? Can you tell us in which sphere? What kind of profession would you like to have? Uh, I'd like to have. Uh, I want to be a teacher. Oh. For, no, in school, maybe in private school. Mm -hmm. What kind of subject? 
English, of course. Okay. <laughs> so you would like to be my colleague, actually. So uh, do you think that you will be happy with your job when you find it? <clears throat> yes. Uh, mm -hmm. I think that I'm... I will really happy when I find a good job. This job. Mm -hmm. this job. Okay. Why do you think so? Why will you be happy? I don't know. Maybe <laughs> I like kids. I like tell they about something. Mm -hmm. I am talkative. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I'm talkative. <laughs> nice, nice comment. Okay, I see. Thank you. Vladimir, what about you? Now you are about to work or you have already started? Um, have I already started work? Okay. Oh, I yes. didn't understand the question. Because I, I, I asked you, you told me that you are going to finish your education, right? Ah, yeah, but mm -hmm. I, I uh, am already working. Mm -hmm. And I like my job uh, uh, because the, I can work uh, remotely. Mm -hmm. uh, I have flexible uh, hours, okay. flexible work day, mm -hmm. and uh, I have uh, uh, good uh, workmates. Yes, and, that's uh, right. Uh, uh, and I think that uh, my job is uh, very interesting and uh, helps me to train my brain. <laughs> okay, so everything is about brain tonight. Tell me please, when you finish, when you get your diploma, are you going to continue working in the same place or you will try to find something different? <laughs> oh, I don't know, uh, but I think I will stay um, in that in the same place mm -hmm. because I like it okay. and maybe I will uh, change it uh, but it will be later mm -hmm. okay in I see. a half and year and half, half a year. year that's good okay Dmitri what about you we can't hear you the microphone No, you can okay. hear. Okay. Yes. Yes, we can. Okay. I like my job because it's for me. It's it's uh, quite easy, mm -hmm. and <laughs> in the same time I have a decent salary. <laughs> <laughs> decent. I like this word. Okay. Uh, I hope I have pronounced it correctly. Yes. Yes. That's right. Decent <laughs> salary. Okay. Okay. Um, Unfortunately, I don't have a team now because mm -hmm. uh, all all my colleagues colleagues mm -hmm. have been fired recently. Oh my God! <laughs> what company, happened? Be because our, of the crisis. Uh, yes, our company is experiencing problems mm -hmm. with money. Okay. So. Uh, so, can, I, can I ask you, do you know the reason why you were the only one left in the company? Uh, <laughs> because you are a superman and you can I, replace I, I, all of them. I think uh, that the others were smart enough to leave the company. Okay, <laughs> I see. <laughs> but I am uh, the dumbest one, I think. Okay, very honest comment from you. And so, are you going to find new people, or you will try to do it as it is now? Uh, our our task today is to make company um, how to say пережить to overcome overcome to overcome, overcome the crisis mm -hmm. and and to start. Uh, getting more income and okay, I see. Maybe, maybe, maybe then we will be able to hire more people. Mm -hmm. Okay. Or maybe, anyway. or maybe I will, I will find another job. Yeah. 
But anyway, I wish you good luck and I will keep my fingers crossed for you, okay, and for your company as well. So guys, we move on and uh, our next task here is to uh, name some jobs that you can see in the picture. So I want you to do it uh, as following. You tell me the name of this job and you try to say one phrase, uh, I mean, what these people do, okay, when they work. Ivan, can you be the first, please? Picture one is for you. Uh, okay, I think it is accountant. Okay, what does he do? Um, maybe he calculating uh, finance documents, I think. Uh -huh. Let it be, okay, thank you. Vlada number two? Uh, it's publishing, uh, and uh, he, da, uh, he speaks uh, publicly. Mm -hmm. So uh, when you say publishing, what do, what do you mean exactly? Who is this person? Oh, politician. Politician, I think, yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, thank you. Alona, next one. It is a teacher. Yeah, a teacher. Uh, what what kind of school? Uh, it's child children's school. <laughs> of course, it's about children. I mean, is it primary school or secondary yeah, primary school? Primary school. Primary school teacher. And what does she do? <coughs> uh, she tell us about I don't know globus. Yes, about globe. Yeah, about the Earth, about the planet. Thank you. It is a bit a picture number four is for you. Um, I think uh, it is fashion designer. Mm -hmm, that's uh, right. What does she do? Uh, uh, she paints uh, some examples of clothes. Mm -hmm. You should say not examples, but when the uh, when we talk about uh, designers, they call them samples. Samples. Okay. Examples. Okay. Thank you. Dmitry, next one, number five. Microphone. Yes, number five. Uh, she is a nurse, I think. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's right. What does she do? Uh, her responsibilities is to wear blue clothes and <laughs> to smile, I think. <laughs> okay. And to, ha to help uh, people how... I don't know the word, but say anti. Patience. 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 Yeah, sure. Okay. It's the same. Uh, and she needs to tell you that you are going to die with a smile on her face, yeah? I hope... I hope not. She, she, she's going to tell it um, someone another. Not okay, me. someone else, but not you. Okay, thank you. Vladimir, picture number six. Uh, yeah, I think it's a footballer. That's right. What does he do? Uh, he plays football. Do you like football? Oh, I think it's correct to say soccer. Soccer, let it be. But do you like soccer? Uh, I watched it before, but mm -hmm. now I don't. Okay, and have you ever played soccer? I played it uh, when I was uh, an adult. Mm -hmm. Who? Who? An adult? An and adult. now who? And then now who you are? Oh. <laughs> I, I <think laughs> so you, are you a child nowadays or a teenager? Oh, um, when you oh, say I adult, mean, it that, means взрослый. Ah, yeah, I mean uh, that uh, teenager. Yeah. Teenager. That's teenager. it. Thank you so yeah. much, Ekaterina. Yeah. Number seven is for you. Mm. I think he's dirigent. How to say it in English? Guys, who knows? Can you help us? Orchestra conductor. That's right. Thank you. Orchestra conductor. Irina, <coughs> can you tell us what this person does? I don't say what he does. Do. No, no. Can you tell us what does he do? Can you? Okay. Ivan, maybe you will help us. Uh, maybe he's uh, control of orchestra. Yes, he, he controls the orchestra and he shows them how to play, what to play, something like that. Thank you. Yes. Vlada, next one is for you. Um, it's a reporter, a reporter and uh, she gives interview for one of TV channels. Uh -huh. Okay, do you find this job interesting? 
Yes, of course. So you can see many countries and cities and many people. Okay, thank you. Vladimir, next one will be specially for you. You don't want to be a soldier? Uh, yeah, I don't want to be a soldier. Okay, and what do these people do? It's a, <laughs> Sniper. a graphics model of oh. a soldier. <laughs> but anyway, it's, it's not really important for us tonight. Yeah. So what do these people do? Uh, they shoot to other people, I suppose. <laughs> they shoot each other. <laughs> no, actually, they need to protect the country, yeah, the border. And or to not to protect, or maybe they can, uh, how can attack. Say? Attack, yeah. Okay, I see. Maybe you will change your mind and you will become a soldier. Who knows? <laughs> no, I don't think so. <laughs> okay, I see. Thank you. I don't know. Next one, number 10. Uh, it's a uh, fire man. <laughs> Firefighter. <laughs> That's right. He's a firefighter. What does he do? He uh, makes fire LS. Oh my god. How to say it correctly? <laughs> how to say Who knows how to say it? Kill. Guys. No, kill. <laughs> kill is about a soldier. There is a special phrasal verb. Put out. Yeah, put, put out. Put out the fire. Okay. So, Alona, do you think this profession is quite dangerous? Uh, yes, mm -hmm. it's profession very dangerous. Okay, I see. Thank you. Dmitry, 11? Uh, 11. Yeah, this is um, a refuse collector. That's right. <laughs> no, he, he drives around the city, mm -hmm. on, inside the city, okay. and uh, looks for uh, trash cans. Okay. Okay, and takes out uh, trash mm -hmm. from them. <laughs> okay. And put it in this big vehicle. Okay. So and, uh, and drive away. And drive away. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So, Lopez, do you do you think this profession is well paid in Russia? Hmm. I don't know what well paid means. Ah, okay. So it depends. Yes, how much is well paid for for you? Okay. Anyway, thank you, Elizabeth. And the last one is for you. Last one. I think she's manager. Manager, you guess? Are you sure? No. You are not. Let's let's think a little bit more. Uh, if I don't know. So uh, the the it's idea. Walter. Uh, sorry, just Walter. Actually, <laughs> my colleagues wanted you to say something like personal assistant. Okay, personal okay. office worker. Yeah, yeah, exactly right. You are. So, what do these people do? Uh, uh they help to manage uh, uh, schedule, help an office with orders. Um. Uh, office stuff like uh, sticker, I don't know, or uh, uh, to call uh, uh, some repairman or IT guy who can change cartridge and printer or something like this. Okay, brilliant. Thank you for the answer. Guys, we move on, we continue. Uh, we can see some professions here. You can see them on the top. They are personal assistant, journalist, politician, nurse, firefighter, designer, and orchestra conductor. And of course, we have some questions for us to discuss. So you can see the questions here. So Ivan, can you read the first one and tell me the answer? Ah, uh, okay. Uh, what people do in these occupations? Oh, I think we have already done it. Can you go to number yes. two? Mm -hmm. uh, which occupation would you most like to do? Why? Mm -hmm. uh, I like uh, the professional designer, of course, okay. because it is creative. Uh, mm -hmm. This is creative profession, and you create something uh, interesting, something new, something uh, innovation. Okay. Uh, I think it is very interesting and very, 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 very. 
<laughs> I don't know. Very, very good. <laughs> uh, can I ask you what kind of designer would you like to be? So, is it going to be landscape, clothes? What is no, your thought? No clothes. I think about uh, designer something. Uh, get devices, maybe, maybe mm -hmm. designer, uh, web, uh, internet designer, maybe, maybe okay. designer of uh, uh, print productions. Mm -hmm. Interesting. Lada, the same question to you. Question number two. Um. Okay. Um, I would like to be a doctor uh, because mm -hmm. I think I have uh, personal abilities to be a doctor. I like to study uh, during the life and I'm open-minded. I like new things and also I like to, have to, to help people and to make them happy, uh, to treat them from the sickness. Mm -hmm. That's good. Uh, can I ask you, are you afraid of blood? No, no, I'm not afraid. That's very good. Good for you. Thank you. Ekaterina, what do you think? Question number two. I'd like <coughs> I'd like to a journalist. To be a journalist. Mm -hmm. To be a journalist. Why? Uh, because uh, it is a very interesting profession. You you may do you made to meet with something people and chat with, chat with them. Mm -hmm. You may yes, not to meet. You may meet with some people. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Aluna. The same one. I would like to be a politician. 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 <gasps> you would like to speak in public and cheat on people. No. And, and get big money for that? I hope no. no. But and what it, it's okay, interesting. You are going to be a good politician, yeah? <laughs> yes. Okay. So why do you want to be? Uh, I think it's more interesting profession from this list. Mm -hmm. Okay. I see. Thank you, Mitri. Which one is yours? I would like to be a firefighter. I knew that. <laughs> Why? <laughs> because I think uh, this is a highly respected profession. Mm -hmm. and these people are very tough and they save lives doing, his, doing their work. So it's great, I think. Okay. And, Thank and, you. Also, and also, they have regular. Physical activities. <laughs> That's good. <laughs> to do it. And you would like to keep fit, yeah, this way. Yeah, yeah. Okay, let it be. Thank you, Elisaveta. Uh, I would like to be a pilot, but oh. <laughs> this profession is not in the list. So okay. I would like to be an orchestra conductor. Okay, why? Uh, why? I think uh, it is uh, a very difficult profession. Uh, to listen music, how uh, orchestra m members play uh, with each other, mm -hmm. and uh, to hear each uh, uh, sound in uh, the flow. Mm -hmm. So I think it is very interesting. This. Okay, brilliant. And uh, as for your profession that you mentioned, first of all, it's a pilot. Don't you think that it's more uh, like a male profession than female? No, I think uh, it is a not male profession. Um, mm, no, no. Okay, okay, I see. Thank you. Vladimir, what about you? Okay, from this list, I would like to do to be a designer or orchestra conductor. <laughs> okay, why, why such different professions? I can't choose between them, but I, uh, I saw uh, how to be an orchestra conductor because I played in orchestra and uh, I would like to uh, try this mm -hmm. occupation. Okay. 
but also about designer, I have a similar uh, job to this uh, profession. Uh -huh. I am a programmer. Okay, and programmer. I, usually, I contact uh, with the designers, mm -hmm. and uh, I think it's uh, interesting and uh, also hard job. So, okay. Yeah, it's uh, so, creative. Yeah, I want you to start uh, answering question number three, actually. Which one you will never ever do? Okay, uh, I would never be a personal assistant, I suppose. Why not? You don't because like to serve people? <laughs> I think I can serve people, but not in this way. I think mm -hmm. it's not uh, interesting for me to deal with a lot of papers. Mm -hmm. Uh, it's not my thing at all. Okay, I see, I get you, thank you. Vlada, which one is not yours for sure? Uh, for sure it's politician. Uh, okay. I'm talking about here bad politician because mm -hmm. um, I don't like uh, dishonest people uh, who say something and do not do it uh, and who drives and uh, responsible for many people. I think mm -hmm. um, not too many people can afford to do it and you need to ensure and to to, uh, to prove everyone always uh, that you are the best and you can lead people. I think it's very difficult. Unfortunately, it's not for me. Okay, I see, I get you. Ivan, the same question to you? <clears throat> I am agree with uh, uh, Dmitry. Uh, okay. Uh, I don't uh, like the personal assistants, of course, and else I don't like nurse. <laughs> no. <laughs> you don't like nurses? What's the trouble? What's the problem? Uh, I don't like nurse. Uh, don't uh, like work nurse. Ah, you don't like to work as a nurse. Okay. Yes, yes. We we talk about uh, what you don't like to mm -hmm. work. That's right. Okay. Uh, but because you think that nurse is uh, mostly a female profession, or why? Yes. What's the problem? Yes, yes, I think it is female profession. Uh, maybe, maybe if you saw, there was one movie. Uh, it's called Meet the Parents. Yes, yes. Tradition. Yeah, and remember there was one yes, guy. I remember, yes, yes. <laughs> he was a nurse, and it was a kind a reason for many jokes. Okay, yes. thank you, Elizaveta. What do you think? Which one you will never do, even for big money? Um. Uh, I think uh, nursing is uh, not for me okay. uh, because it is very hard to no, it is very hard for me to see six people mm -hmm. uh, and uh, and that's all. That's it. I see. Thank you, Alona. <coughs> I don't want to be a nurse too <laughs> uh, because. Okay. I will have a lot of sad experience, mm -hmm. and if I will a nurse, I will live on my work uh, because I will переживать. Uh, how to say, guys? Help us. Переживать. Experience. Worry. 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 Yes. Worry, Worry. about. People. Sure. About my parents. Patient. You will worry and you will feel sorry for them. Yeah, maybe you will cry all the time and will be very nervous. Yeah, I guess so. Yes. Thank you, Ekaterina. Oh. Which profession is not for you? Oh, I think that politician is not for me because mm -hmm. it is a very hard profession. I think okay. uh, you every day you. You must mm -hmm. to decide to very problems of all country. Mm -hmm. I think it is very hard. Okay, every day you need to get a lot of money and to say some uh, lie. <laughs> it's very hard, <laughs> really. Yes. Okay. Thank you, guys. And uh, the last question here is for us uh, to try to evaluate how much money these people might get. So I want you to tell me the highest salary and the lowest salary for sure. So, Lada, can you be the first? I mean, we are talking about these professions. Uh, just from this list. Yeah, 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 from this list for sure. Okay. 
I would say that um, any of this profession, uh, if person works on his own, so mm -hmm. let's say a journalist, and he makes or she makes something unique and special, mm -hmm. uh, she can charge a lot of money for her job. So that's why I believe that it would be the highest salary. Mm -hmm. uh, the lowest salary, I would say that it will be nerf because if people are working in um, government, Mm -hmm. and they always have low salary because government has strict budget which needs to be uh, meet in the end of the year. Yeah, I see. I get your point. Thank you. Vladimir, how do you see it? The highest and the lowest sal salary? Okay. Uh, I think that lowest salary that nurses has uh, uh, have lo lowest salary. Mm -hmm. uh, but also they have a uh, hard job and yeah. it's strange. Uh, uh, also, if I'm not sure about which country we talk about, but I suppose about Russia. <laughs> yes, uh, sure. I suppose that a journalist is, uh, 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 has a high, the highest salary mm -hmm. uh, and I will agree with Vlada mm -hmm. at this point okay. because a lot of uh, uh, journalists or bloggers can uh, uh, be like individual uh, mm -hmm. journalists and uh, have their own opinion and also they have uh, uh, ad advertisement in mm -hmm. their blogs and they can get a lot of money. On mm -hmm. so. Okay, I see. Get you. Thank you, Mitri. Where have you been? Somewhere under the table. Mm. What do you think about number four? Uh, I think uh, politicians are the most. Uh, politicians can be uh, the most well-paid. The, the most well-paid people here mm -hmm. because they have. Access to their budget. yes <laughs> budget of their the budget of the country yeah countries. so and uh, the poorest one mm -hmm. is a nurse okay poor nurse nobody nobody thinks that uh, they get a lot of money but actually this is our reality yeah uh, yes. At least in Russia, it's it's true. Yeah, I see. Thank you, Elizaveta. What's your opinion? Uh, I think it is nurse. Yes. Okay. So it is yeah. the lowest salary, right? Well, lower than. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. uh, and maybe personal assistant or politician. Mm -hmm. Or Has designer, for example, uh, may have the highest. Yes. Mm -hmm. So it depends, I guess. Yes, it depends on your work, how much you work, and uh, something that you do. Okay, mm -hmm. Alona, how do you see? It? Uh, unfortunately, nurse. Have a okay. low nurse is the champion tonight. Okay. Yes, and if you high-level politician, you can take money from the states. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. Why do you think so? Do you think it's so simple just to come and take grab some money? In Russia, I think it's okay. not difficult if you really uh, high level. High level politician. I see. Thank you, Ivan. What do you think? Uh, I fully fully agree with Dmitry, and mm -hmm. I think that uh, high salary for politician, high politician. If you dishonest mm -hmm. politician, of course, you have a good salary. Mm -hmm. I think. Uh, and the low salary, of course, uh, in the champion of this evening, uh, it is nurse. Oh my God! Okay, poor nurse. I see. So, guys, I think we can move on. Thank you very much for your opinions. I hope that this situation will somehow improve in future. So, uh, we are going to the next point. Here we can see different professions. We have mentioned some of them tonight. Actually, all of them. And every time I will t I will say your name, I will give you the profession, and you need to choose 
the professional qualities from this list for each of them. Vladimir, can you be the first? And I want you to tell us about, um, let it be, soldier. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I'm sorry. I'm sorry for that. Come on. Okay. Uh, it, it, it's important for a soldier mm -hmm. uh, to be uh, to be uh, flexible. Yeah, to be hard <laughs> okay. You mean, be you mean organized. physically flexible? <laughs> what? Uh, I in physically flexible. In yeah. Always, I suppose. Okay. Uh, because you uh, you should able to wake up at night uh, or mm -hmm. during all day. Okay. You need to do some things. Okay. Uh, yeah. Also, uh, you need to be able to work with a team. Mm -hmm. uh, to be communicative. Mm -hmm. I suppose enthusiastic too. <laughs> I'm not sure. Uh, um, That's it. To be confident uh, mm -hmm. and to be responsible. I okay. suppose. One one little remark for one word. It's communicative. Yeah. Communicative. Yeah, commun okay. not communicative, but communicative. Okay. Okay. I see. Thank you, Alona. Uh, can you please tell us about the primary teacher? Uh, primary teacher should to be a hard worker mm -hmm. and friendly okay. and communicative mm -hmm. and to be creative. To be creative, yeah? Yes. Okay, thank you. Elizaveta, your profession tonight is a designer. Let's go. A uh, designer uh, should be creative, mm -hmm. sensitive, I okay. think, and uh, uh, well organized. Okay. Um, and it's all. That's all. Nobody wants to say assertive. Guys, do you know this word? No. No? <laughs> Nobody knows this word. Okay, I will give you some no, time. To... Yes, something like that. Mm -hmm. Okay. Ivan, can you continue with a footballer? Uh, okay. Uh, I think you need to be uh, organized mm -hmm. uh, to be able to work with a team. Uh, maybe you need to be assertive, of course. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, you need to be enthusiastic. Uh, maybe you need to be co communicative. Communicative, yeah. When you come to your manager to talk about your salary, yeah? Uh, yes, yes, yes. <laughs> okay. When you uh, change your team. Yeah? <laughs> of course. Yes, why not? <laughs> Thank you. Ekaterina, a uh, nurse will be for you. Um, a nurse should be a hard worker mm -hmm. and able to work within team. Okay. Sensitive, maybe, and yeah. good, good listener. Good listener, yeah, I guess so. Vlad, I want you to tell us about an orchestra conductor. Um, if he is male, um, mm -hmm. it's important for him uh, to be uh, to be able to work with team because he's a leader. Mm -hmm. uh, also, he needs to be friendly. Uh, it means to get along with people. Uh, also, he needs to be creative mm -hmm. because he needs uh, to focus attention of audience, mm -hmm. and he needs to be uh, confident in what he really does. Mm -hmm. Thank you very much. So, uh, Dmitry, the one for you will be an accountant. Uh, an accountant. Okay. It's important for an accountant to be, uh, I think, to be organized mm -hmm. and, uh, and responsible. And that's mm -hmm. all. And for that's accountant. all. <laughs> 
interesting and to be able to count yeah w yeah. without a calculator something like that okay guys uh, now it's time for you to remember how professional you are and try to describe yourself as a worker as an employee Vladimir can you be the first please choose something from this list about yourself okay um. I am able to work on my own, mm -hmm. but I can't say that I'm organized. <laughs> okay. Uh, I am friendly, I suppose. Mm -hmm. Okay. I'm able to work with the team. I'm a commun communicative. Mm. That's it. I am decisive. Decisive. Ah, decisive and uh, responsible for my part of the job. Mm -hmm. Interesting, thank you. Ivan, how do you see yourself as a worker? Ivan? Ivan sorry, so sorry, oh, okay, sorry, okay, my on. microphone uh, mm -hmm. was switched off. Uh, it is important for me to be able to work on my own. Of mm -hmm. course, uh, sometimes I am hard worker. Okay. Uh, I am try to be confident in my sphere. Mm -hmm. uh, of course, I am. Uh, I think I am friendly okay. and co communicative. Thank you. Sometimes I try to be creative mm -hmm. and um, assertive, of course. If we, mm -hmm. Yes, if I want to uh, achieve my goals. Mm -hmm. Thank you very much. Elisaveta, tell us about yourself. Okay. Mm, I'm responsible for my work. Okay. Um, uh, <laughs> and that's all. <laughs> and that's all. <laughs> I'm not friendly. I'm mm -hmm. not able to work with a team. Okay. I'm well organized mm -hmm. and uh, I hard work all this. Okay. Okay. When we finish, I will tell you two interesting words about being hard working. Alona, you are next. I think I'm a hard worker and mm -hmm. I hope that I'm friendly. Uh, I able to work with a team mm -hmm. <coughs> and. I think I'm responsible. That's good. That's all. Mm -hmm. Wonderful. Thank you. Ekaterina, a uh, question to you. When you become a teacher, finally, how, what kind of professional you will be? I, if I would be a teacher, I will friendly, communicative and creative. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think that's the most important things. For, for the teachers. Dmitri, what about you? <laughs> Sometimes I can be a hard worker. Uh, usually I'm not um, organized. Uh, I am definitely able to work on my own. Mm -hmm. uh, I am not friendly enough, I think. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Do you, do you work on that? Do you want to be friendlier? Mm, yes, I'm trying to mm -hmm. to become to become more friend uh, to become friendlier. Friendlier, okay. Yes, but uh, I have mm, I have received a lot of uh, <laughs> negative feedback. Okay, I see. <laughs> so pe people didn't notice your tryings, yeah? Mm, yes, sometimes I. I f forget to to, <laughs> to, say hello? to no to re respond to answer mm -hmm. some people when they ask me something. Mm -hmm. uh, I think that's because of my mm, bad memory. Okay. Okay, but uh, <laughs> it's not the end because I'm able to work with a team. Mm -hmm. I'm not very communicative. Sometimes I'm very enthusiastic, enthusiastic, mm -hmm. okay. and uh, most of the time I 
I am responsible. Oh, that's brilliant. Guys, who I haven't asked? Vladimir, was it you? Did I ask you? Uh, Julia, it's me. I just continue. Oh. Okay, okay. Um, it's, um, so I think that I'm a sort of person because mm -hmm. I can share my point of view and explain that it's correct. Mm -hmm. I also believe that I'm decisive because mm -hmm. I can make decision and be responsible uh, for the result mm -hmm. and I can show my initiative uh, and to show results of my work. Mm -hmm. That's brilliant. So, uh, guys, if you look in our chat, I will show you two words. You know, one of them we have the same in Russian. Yes, it sounds like workaholic, and another one is workaholic. Both of these words mean uh, some people who work really hard and they spend most of their time at work. But there is one certain difference between these two words. Workaholic works a lot and actually he's not happy with this position. He doesn't like that, but he has to work. And workaholic is a guy or girl. Uh, they work a lot and they love it. You know, there are such people who love their work and they are ready to <coughs> leave there, to sleep in the sofa in the office and just to be there like 24-7, something like that. So the, these two words, uh, there are in English and so you can use them. And actually, you, if, you, if, you, if you want, you can write in our chart who you are, workaholic or workaholic, okay? And if, only if you want to, I, I don't insist. We continue anyway. So we have some questions to discuss here, and uh, I, I offer us to do that quite quickly, okay? So we do it as Russian roulette, as we do it as always. So Dmitry, I want you to be the first. Can you choose the person and can you choose the question for this person? Microphone. Of course, I can choose a person and and the question. Okay. The question <laughs> is: uh, What three things are the most important for you in a job? Why? Mm, and the questions uh, go to Alona. Okay. Mm, the first things: It's a project. Project should be interesting for me. And the second thing, it's a team, mm -hmm. uh, because uh, people uh, which around who you, who who are around you, mm -hmm. who are around you, uh, should to подходить um, should suit you should suit. suit. To me, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. and third thing, it's a salary. I think mm -hmm. uh, that's all. That's all. Thank you, Alona. You choose the person. Choose the question. I choose Vladimir. Okay. And uh, second question: Do you have to work overtime? If so, do you get paid more for overtime work? Mm -hmm. Okay. Thanks. Uh, I don't have to work overtime, and because I have flexible hours mm -hmm. per month and I just need to work these hours. Okay. And, that's all. and if you work more than agreed, will you get some extra payment? Uh, usually I don't need to mm -hmm. uh, work overtime. Mm -hmm. uh, so I don't get paid more. Okay, okay, let it be, thank you. Vladimir, you know what to do, come on. Uh, yeah, okay, third question, are there many good job vacancies for you in your country? And, for example, Ivan. Okay. Uh, I think, yes, uh, in our country, uh, I can choose uh, many good jobs vacancies for Thanks. my... Vacancies, yes, for, for me. <laughs> That's good. I'm good for you, really. Okay, Ivan, come yes. on, continue. Uh, okay, number four. Have you ever had a part time job? Is If so, what did you do? Uh, it is, this is questions for Dmitry, I think. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, no, I I haven't. 
<laughs> so this is not, it's not a good question for me. Maybe you choose another. Yeah, Simon, you, you can you choose another person? Uh, no problem, Elizaveta maybe. Mm -hmm. Yes, I uh, once I uh, had uh, a part-time job. I worked uh, a barman in okay. the bar. After uh, uh, my lessons in university. That's good. It's better to say bartender. Bartender. Okay. Bartender. Okay. So, and uh, when did you stop when you finished university? Uh, no, uh, I stopped before uh, the exams. Mm -hmm. Okay. I see. Get you. Thank you. Elisaveta, you know what to do? Um, okay. Uh, Dimitri. This question is for you. The next. Number five. Uh, okay, is it typical for men and women to have the same jobs in your country? Uh, no, it isn't. Uh, there are jobs that um, mostly occupied by, the, by women. <laughs> <laughs> no. And which ones? Can you give us some examples? For example, trolley bus driver. Or <laughs> oh my god! Or tram driver. <laughs> Would you or, like to be one of them? Or cashier. Mm -hmm. okay. okay. I no, I wouldn't. Yes, and bus drivers are usually male. male. <laughs> I don't know why. <laughs> This is the difference. Yeah, it depends on the type of transport. <laughs> yeah. I see. Good. Dmitry, come on. Uh -huh. If you were so well off that you didn't need to work, would you give up your job? What would you do? Um, uh, Vlada? Mm -hmm. uh, if I have a lot of money, I would uh, give up my job and mm -hmm. run out of Moscow and go somewhere near the sea. Okay. And I would buy a house and rent it, part of it, and live for such money. That's very good. I'm sorry, Vlad, wouldn't it be boring? No, no, it wouldn't be boring because <laughs> I would travel a lot and uh, make some donations. Uh, I would find interesting things. Really, believe me. <laughs> That's good. Very nice. Vlada, can you ask Ekaterina? Choose any question you want. Uh, Ekaterina. Um, question number first. What do you think? Uh, what three things are the most important for you in your job? Because uh, we know that uh, you are looking for job as a teacher. Okay. <coughs> I think that most important for my future job will uh, friendly workmates, mm -hmm. uh, pleasant atmosphere to work, and and flexible work hours. <laughs> yeah, maybe not flexible, but for teachers they are usually short. Yeah, you can work like half a day, for example, six classes, and you can go home. Maybe. Yes. Okay, thank you so much. Guys, it's time for us. We are coming to the end. And the last thing here for us is debate. And there is a question we need to talk about. It's impossible to find your ideal job. Okay? And I will split you into two halves. So, Ekaterina, Ivan, Vlada, and Vladimir, you will agree with that. Okay? And try to think about your arguments, how to prove this point of view. And Alona, Dmitri, and Elizaveta, you are against this point of view, you disagree, and you need to think about your arguments um, as well. So I give you just 30 minutes maybe to think it over, and we will start. I'm sorry, you just said 30 minutes? No, I'm oh, sorry, 30 seconds, I'm so sorry. <laughs> yeah, 30 minutes, and we will finish in the morning, really. <laughs> Sorry for that. Okay. So, Vlada, can you be the first? I would like to know your argument for this statement. Mm -hmm. uh, 
I fully agree that it's impossible uh, to find an ideal job, unfortunately, because uh, life is changed and what is ideal today would not be ideal tomorrow. That's why a person who is looking for a job needs to be very sensitive and react uh, very quickly for such changes. So that's why I do not think that it's uh, possible to find an ideal job. Thank you very much. Elisabetta, can you say something uh, opposite? Uh, yes, I totally disagree. Mm -hmm. uh, ideal job, it is uh, not a very huge deal. Mm -hmm. uh, well paid, uh, friendly atmosphere, uh, comfortable office, and uh, well, what you want more uh, to call it uh, ideal. I think uh, it's perfect. You mm -hmm. can come uh, and do a job uh, like you want. Okay, thank you. Ivan, something mm. to add? Uh, I think it is impossible. Uh, I think uh, I, I disagree that it's uh, impossible to find your ideal job because if you want something, you can um, uh, work with, uh, you can get it. <laughs> if you uh, something, if you like something, you you this is uh, maybe your work. I think, mm -hmm. for example, you can you work on your own and uh, doing what you like. Okay, but you didn't get me. My task for you was to agree with that. You uh, are in the group of people who agree with that. This is. I'm it. sorry. But, but anyway, but don't I worry. disagree. Mm -hmm. I cannot <laughs> agree with it. Uh, you cannot agree. Okay, yes. I see. I get you. Thank you, Alona. What do you think about this issue? I'm sure that it's not true because mm -hmm. I have an ideal job. Oh, you think so? Yes, I'm oh. sure. I'm sure. So everything is okay, and you are totally happy. Don't want anything else. Yes. Mm -hmm. That's good. Ekaterina, you are a person who is looking for a job, so I think it's an urgent issue for you. What do you think? You need to agree. Uh, I agree that it is impossible to find my ideal job mm -hmm. because, uh, because uh, <laughs> okay, so I give you some time. Can you think it over and then you will tell us? Dmitry, how do you see this? Oh, I'm sorry. Okay, I'm, I disagree that it's impossible to fight your ideal job because uh, you asked me to disagree, okay? <laughs> okay. <laughs> uh, okay, but I have a a reason. Mm -hmm. uh, it's possible to find your ideal job. Uh, it, uh, a job is ideal if it matches with your hobby, with your favorite occupation, I think. Mm -hmm. So, and every person in the world, I hope, have a hobby. <laughs> yeah, sure. And the only thing you need to do is to to get paid for that. Mm -hmm. Okay, interesting. Vladimir, you need to agree with that. Okay, I think it's not uh, hard to agree with that uh, because uh, you can't find the ideal job because every time you will uh, find something that will not fit you and you can find it in another place, but in another place you will not be able to get something else in, and it can uh, be continuous and uh, you all, all, all your life you will try to find uh, your ideal job mm -hmm. and uh, finally you won't find it. <laughs> you won't yeah. find it. So you, you will understand that you have spent all your life trying to find it, yeah? Yeah. And then you die. <laughs> and you die, yeah. yeah. Brilliant. 
very positive end. We have Gatilina, have you remembered what you wanted to say? Yes. <laughs> Come on. Um, I agree because um, uh, many jobs need to um, big experience mm -hmm. from new worker and you haven't experienced and you lost this possibility this possibility mm -hmm. okay. to work in your and your mm -hmm. job thank you so much so guys thank you very much for your ideas for your experience sharing and I really hope that if not now one day you will get your ideal job for sure and uh, as for now enjoy what you have and be absolutely happy thank you very much for being with me wish you a nice evening and hope to see you next time thank you uh, thank, thank you. you see you next bye. time bye see you bye, bye. bye.